Hi, I'm Noelle Hyman with paperclipping.com and we are in the Lawn Fawn booth and we're going to look at their new stamps and dies and a few of their other things. Here they actually have a lot of, of stamps and dies that have come out at this show. Most of them have a coordinating die cut. So for example, this one goes with this one and that's what I love, the, I, the possibility of having a stamp with a die to cut it out. So that looks like that goes with the camera here. Uh, here's this TV, I think that's a TV right there or some kind of a frame, maybe it's just a frame. <laughs> um, right here, this one goes with that. This, uh, a couple of them don't. This one actually goes with a collection that we'll look over on the other side so it doesn't have a coordinating uh, die, but the rest of these do. We've got some sushi. Look how cute the little faces here to go with the sushi roll theme um, and all the little pieces to cut it out. We, we've got a sailing theme over here with its dies. Map. So if you want to be able to cut out your United States of America or your globe or the arrows, we've got the cuts here or the dies there. There's a floral one with a congratulations for cards. If we come down below this way, here's a few, uh, uh, well, let's come down a little bit farther this way just to give you an idea of a few of the others. Um, and now let's go back the opposite direction so we can see a few things. Here's some die cuts that don't need stamps. These are for little edging border type things. So for example, this, this grass right here goes with this die. And uh, let's see, we've got this cute little scallop grass right here with the stitches cut through from that uh, other die that's right next to this one. And this right here, you may not recognize what that is right away. And I just put away the card that was using it. So let's, let's pull that card back out again, right here. So they use just part of that die to get the speech bubble in there. And they've got dinosaurs. And this is a great little background stamp. It doesn't have a die to go with that, obviously. But they also have this, this die right here that they've had for a while. It's a, a tag die that's been very popular. And so they created some stamps to go with it. And they're going to continue to build on this particular die so that you can use other things to go with that die cut. They have a Project Life type die cut that I missed somewhere. And it's right over here. Thank you. So what they've got here is it's an ability to cut out a four by six piece of paper with the stitched the stitching to go around it and it's got the rounded corners and I'll show you an example they had one before for the three by four size that a lot of people are loving and it's got that stitching right there and it's been very popular and so they decided to add a four by six one to go along with that and that will also and that one also does that stitching that goes along the border okay so I mentioned the hello sunshine uh, the Hello Sunshine, here we are, stamps, right there. And we're gonna go take a look at the paper line that goes along with that. We'll just head out over this way. And we've got these really bright, cheery colors. We've got polka dots. This is their basic polka dot line. Or it's called polka, actually. And they've got diagonal stripes. And here we. If we come along this way, we've got these Hello Sunshine papers. You've got cutouts that you can do if you do if you like to do the pocket pages, or you don't have to cut them out for pocket pages. And some fun little patterns here. We've got clouds. And then here's something I think is great. They make these little cards that you can then embellish. What I think, what I like about this is if you are a card maker who likes to make your own envelopes, they sell their envelopes separately so that you don't have to buy the envelopes if you don't need them. Well, uh, one other thing that we haven't seen yet are, is the twine. So we're going to come back this way and take a look at the twine. There's the red and light blue, kind of a pastel coral and a neutral gray. And these are other colors that they've already had that you may have seen before or may not have seen. We've got 
uh, quite, a, quite a number of colors of twine. So this is all Lawn Fawn. This is a company that's growing in popularity. We're hearing about more and more. People really like getting stamps with dyes that they can just punch out their stamps. So you might want to take a look if you're interested in stamping and die cutting and card making. I am Noelle Hyman with paperclipping.com.